Have you ever looked at your lab report and saw a bunch of words and numbers that just don't make sense to you? If you answered yes, you are not alone. Hello, it's Nosmo from Rofo. Let's talk about lipid panel. Lipid panel is the test that checks the amount of fat in your blood and your risk for developing heart disease. We are going to break it down together so you can feel more confident when you receive your lab report. When you look at your result, a letter H is used to indicate a result that is higher than normal and a letter L to indicate a result that is lower than normal. Always pay attention to the letters so you know if your numbers are high or low. One of the levels checked in lipid panel is the total cholesterol. Total cholesterol level is the total amount of cholesterol in your blood. The goal of total cholesterol is for it to be under 200. But if your total cholesterol is high, lifestyle changes can help to bring the numbers down. Low density lipoprotein or LDL cholesterol is the bad cholesterol. LDL moves cholesterol into the blood vessel. That's why it's called the bad one. You want your LDL level to be under 100. If your LDL is high, it can lead to plaque building up in your arteries, which is atherosclerosis, and eventually increase the risk of heart attacks. You can reduce your LDL cholesterol levels by eating a diet that is low in saturated and trans fats together with regular exercises and weight management. In some cases, medications may also be needed. So follow your doctor's recommendation. High density lipoprotein or HDL cholesterol is the good cholesterol. HDL helps clear out excess cholesterol from the blood vessel and take it to the liver so the liver can sort it out. And then that will help to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. You should aim for HDL that is higher than 40 if you are male or higher than 50 if you are female. If your HDL levels are lower than normal, regular exercises can help increase it. Triglycerides are the fats from the food we eat. We need them for energy storage and they are released when we need energy. But believe it or not, they can be too high. Triglycerides under 150 is considered healthy and within normal limit. When triglycerides are too high, they increase the risk of heart disease as well. Your triglyceride levels may be high if you have diabetes, obesity, or if you drink too much alcohol. In order to improve your lipid panel, you need to focus on a healthier diet, eat less sugar, and increase movement with regular exercises. Thank you so much for watching and learning from this video. Like, subscribe, and follow me to stay updated. If you have any questions, you can drop them in the comment section. See you next time.